guys. Welcome back to another episode of Corvettes 918. I want to thank you for hitting that play button and coming along with me uh, as we go through the journey with having a Corvette Z06. Well, if you're brand new to the channel, I want to say welcome. Um, just go ahead and hit the subscribe button now because I, I tell you what, if you love cars and if you love Corvettes and you like drone footage, let me just and this is gonna be the video for you. This is gonna be the channel for you. And do a lot of great things here. I give away, uh, give away stuff all the time uh, because this channel is really not so much about me making videos, but it's about you guys. Uh, it's just a way for me to meet a lot of new people that uh, have a love for Corvettes or whatever kind of car it is that you might have. You know, I enjoy getting all the emails and just the, the, the comments that you guys drop on these videos. Um, it's getting, uh, it's getting pretty crazy now because if you haven't noticed, if you've been on the channel for a while, we're about to hit 3K. In today's video, guys, it's gonna be kind of two part. Number one, I'm gonna do a real quick uh, install of a product that uh, several guys on my Corvette Club use and have uh, a lot of good things to say about it. It's something that you won't use all the time. Um, some guys think it looks thinks it looks dorky, but I'm gonna tell you what it does serve a purpose And I think you need to retrofit your you know at least put this on your car so that if you need to use it It's ready to go. I mean literally once you install it and the installation doesn't take long But once you actually do it you you can take this on and off in like a minute it doesn't take long at all And what it's called is it's called Nova stretch um, and basically if you've ever seen some Corvettes driving around and they've got, you know, some of them have like leather all up through here and it's the same color as their car. But what this is for is kind of really, like I said, is a bumper mask. And where this is gonna come into play for you guys are when you're gonna be out there doing those early morning cruises. You know, if you guys ever, maybe you're gonna do a long cruise on a Saturday and you get up and everybody's leaving at, you know, it's starting to get light outside at six o'clock. Um, that's when all the bugs are out. Oh, or you're coming back from a cruise, it's late in the evening and the bugs are out. Not that you're really worried about getting bugs on the windshield or on the front of the car or anything like that, but guys, the radiator. These things, this thing is gonna save your radiator from so much junk they would otherwise get sucked up in it. Uh, it's a great product, it allows everything to breathe so it's not, you know, the car's not gonna overheat with this on it or anything like that, uh, but again, it does help, you know, I'm sure it does help a little bit against any type of little rocks and different things like that from, you know, maybe doing, you know, serious, uh, any type of chips or something to the car, depending on what you might have on it. Heck, you may have Expel or you may have a ceramic coating on it already. Uh, oh, guys, I will put in the description down there, let me turn my phone this way. You can use promo code NCCC. So that's the letter N C C C. So three C's for a 10% off, get you 10% off of it. So if this is something you're interested in, uh, again, I think it's something once you see it on the car, I, I think you'll see the benefit in having it. So the first thing I'm gonna do, and guys, if you like the car cover, it's, it's a very basic car cover, but it does the job. Um, and I, when I take it off, I just kind of take it and I kind of lay it into here. Uh, it just basically the biggest thing is just kind of keeping all the little dust, dirt, junk like that off of the car. Because of course I've got black. Um, and as I've, as one viewer told me, as one family member told me, Chuck, black is a color. Black is a second job. He's absolutely right. That she looked beautiful, guys. What more can a guy ask for, really? turn the wheel all the way to the right it's gonna give me a little bit more room underneath the first wheel that I'm gonna do to put this on I'm also gonna go ahead and pop the lid pop the hood I guess it could say because we're gonna need to get into that here in a little bit 
guys, you're gonna need a T20 and a T10 as far as hex heads. Which Corvette you have, um, some Corvettes, uh, This, this shouldn't be anything that's riveted on. And you're gonna put three of these screws in. And it's, it's so, for, so that you can snap, they're just snap heads. So you're just gonna replace those. Okay, that's how quick that is. We're gonna do the other side. Guys, I wish everything was this simple. Be nice, wouldn't it? Okay. So what I would recommend doing is at this point, go ahead and put the Nova Stretch on so that you can see exactly where um, everything is going to line up. Where you need to put your undercarriage bolts or the undercarriage, because there's gonna be some different ones there. So all I'm doing guys is I'm just gonna snap them right on. Guys, at what I've done here is I've just put this on. I'm gonna go actually go ahead and open the hood here. And there is going to be of course, this is where your seven millimeter is gonna come in handy, is putting on the bottom three. Now, if you have a Stingray, Stingrays you're only gonna have, even if it's a, a Z51 package, you're only gonna be able to put two on here. If you have a Z06 or a Grand Sport, there's gonna be three that you'll put on. Now, one thing that some of you guys are going to probably run into and i'm not for sure you'll want to get underneath your car and take a look is um some of these are riveted not all if you're 2016 or 2015 or 2014 now the z06 of course didn't come out to the 15 but you're not going to have um rivets underneath here from from what i understand Okay, then what you're gonna do next, guys, is this little piece of plastic right here. It just pulls up. It's kinda of like a little snap right there, a little deal right here. I'm going to take this piece, which is gonna be at the top of both sides, and you're just going to put it right around the... Take you guys off here so you can see it. As you can see, I just, this piece of plastic or rubber or whatever you want to call it, it just sits right here. And you're just gonna put that little band right around it. And that's gonna hold this up here. Bringing this up. Let's see if I can do this one-handed. Can't bring my hand here. <laughs> Pretty much it. That goes right back in this, right back into place there. And this is pretty much what you have. You know, again, what it's protecting more of is, you know, just kind of everywhere where the radiator would be. It's just simply going to tuck right around the corner here. And, and it stay, it's, it's pretty snug. Once you stretch it, it's there.
know, this weekend we're remembering all the men and women who have, you know, they're the best of who we are as a country. You know, from the World War I, Revolutionary War, you know, for the last 241 years, people have been dying to give us the freedoms that the whole world desires. And that is the freedom to get up every morning and go out and make something of yourself and, you know, to accomplish whatever it is you want to do in life, regardless of you being a male or you being a female or your race or religion. And that's the goal, that's the idea, that's the purpose of this country. The military is they represent the best of who we are as a country. There are people who look past their own wants and they look to, at other people's needs. And, you know, if you're a retired military person, if you're active military, I want to tell you, you know, from my, from my heart to yours, thank you. Thank you for everything that you do. You know, we as the citizens in which you protect can never tell you how much we appreciate you. We can never show you our gratitude for what you do for us. And so, you know, guys, this week, as you know, you're enjoying that Monday off, um, if you have the ability to have that Monday off, you know, make sure you remember it's not about just having another day at the lake. It's not about just having another day off, but it's a day of remembrance. It's, it's to remember those who have given the ultimate price to give us the ability to have something like what I'm standing in front of. So guys, here's a little bit of what we do here at the Billy family as far as getting our house ready for this memorable weekend. until I see you next Saturday morning at 9 a.m. I want to tell you I appreciate you. 
I want to thank you for coming along with me and I want to show you guys some beautiful cars that you guys have sent in. So I hope you enjoy it. I hope each and every one of you have a safe holiday weekend. And remember, thank a vet this weekend. Buy them lunch, do something for them. Guys, we'll see you next Saturday. And I didn't understand